Hey, what's up, Titans, and welcome to Insider. I'm your host, Michelle Suarez, bringing you the inside scoop here today at World Games Expo. Let's check it out. I'm here today with... Ricky. And Ricky, I want to ask you, how did you hear about this event today? I attend like uh, different uh, sport classes and one of the classes is volleyball and our teacher she's part of like these new sports and trying to to put in the country and try to spread it so I, I heard uh, first time from my teacher and what are you looking forward to most today well after lunch I will have a history classes and then I will play uh, volleyball for the intramurals so I'm waiting to play that life for three four hours today is there a particular sport that you're interested in learning more about today? Um, today I was interested to, uh, to learn about these new uh, sports and well I, I, I practice also volleyball, badminton, tennis and climbing and so on so I just like uh, want to get better and better in those sports. Yeah absolutely and so have you ever participated in a team sport? Yes, like my first team sport was uh, football and then I did uh, basketball, volleyball and then I was individual sports so like yeah I'm kind of like used to team sports or individual one also. Yeah. And have you visited the food trucks yet? No, not yet because I was busy playing and so like first playing and then eating. <laughs> yeah absolutely well thank you so much. Yeah, thank you very much it was a pleasure. <laughs> here today with Anna. I'm the Tech Sports Vice President. Rio, I'm the President of the Tech Sports. Anna and Rio, how did you hear about this event today? So I was wa walking across campus and I saw a poster about the ASI promoting the World um, Games Expo and I thought it would be a good opportunity to present a new sport. We are the new club on campus, so we want to promote our sports, the tech sports, which is a mix of soccer and a tennis, uh, soccer and table tennis, or a mix of volleyball and a t table tennis. So we wanted to promote our sports, and then we jumped on it. What are you most looking forward to seeing today? So uh, we want it as a club to have the exposure to the sport for the students on campus, and also to have to make them have fun playing those sports. So I think that's our major goal. I think this is a great opportunity for students to be connected to each other. Since this is a commuter campus, not, student, not many students interact with each other. But throughout this event, I, w I hope people get to know each other and will hopefully they're going to come back for the club event. And is there a particular sport that you're interested in learning more about today? So instead of uh, joining, uh, joining the event, we wanted to promote the sport. So I wanted people to know about our sports rather than looking for the sports but I see a lot of uh, many different kinds of sports it looks very interesting so I'll check it out after this and have you ever been involved in a team sport so I used to play on the uh, volleyball club here on campus and back in Brazil I used to be a volleyball athlete so now we are here to promote tech volley that is a mix of volleyball and also table tennis um, but also soccer. Rio was a soccer player. You can talk more about that. Yeah, I've been playing soccer for my entire life. Uh, the main reason I came to the U.S., I came from Japan, but main reason was to play in the D1 level and to get selected as a professional soccer player in MLS. So I've been playing my soccer all my life. And have you guys visited the food trucks yet? <laughs> Not yet. I'm hopeful that I can go over there after this interview because everything is smelling so good and I have seen a couple of people walking with their food. It looks delicious. I'm going for it. <laughs> I'm going to get that delicious crepe right now. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for your time here today. Thank you and follow us on Instagram, Titan Tech. Thank you so much. Here today with ASI club members Mercedes Avila programmer and Peter Kobimar the ICA events coordinator and you and your team have planned this amazing event for us and I want to ask what are you most looking for today at this event uh, we're looking forward to getting students to have more knowledge about cultural sports and aspects of everything uh, World Expo games is just for students to come out to get knowledge and get experience with these games 
And then we're just here like helping student orgs uh, showcase their cultural activities and also their pastime. So we're actually very excited about this today. Yeah, absolutely. And if there was one thing that you can sh share with us to the Cal State Fullerton community um, about this event, what would it be? Knowledge, having knowledge on different cultural backgrounds because not all of us know and getting to know these clubs and knowing your resources on campus. And then these like intercultural exchanges, just like having fun, participating in our activities, participating in like each other's cultures. So I'm really excited about that and having lots of fun with this today. Yeah, absolutely. And now I want to talk a little bit about your involvement with ASI. So what made you want to get involved with Associated Students, Inc.? So I started off with Street Team, which is part of ASI programming. And I just wanted to get involved with the school and see what our school has to offer. And the more I kept getting involved, the higher position I was able to get. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I was actually more involved in like other satellite campuses, um, so like Cal Poly Pomona, uh, Cal State Northridge, but I just wanted like an on-campus community here at Cal State Fullerton, so that's the reason why I joined ASI here. And how can a Cal State Fullerton student get involved with ASI? ASI Street Team is a great way to start getting involved. You volunteer, you get to choose your hours, you get to choose when you could come in. We have so many different events coming up this month. Uh, this coming up Thursday, we have a movie night which people can volunteer to come help out with. Uh, the way that I found out you can participate in ASI is just going on our ASI website. Uh, there's a lot of commissions that you can apply for. Um, and there's like also like GPA requirements and other things that you can do to participate in our campus. So it's really fun. You also get a stipend for it too. So it's awesome to participate in stuff like this. So Thank you both so much for being here and I hope you have an amazing rest of the event. Be sure to follow ASI CSUF on Instagram to keep up with all of their exciting events. Thank you to everyone at World Games Expo. I'm your host, Michelle Suarez, and I'll see you next time on Insider. Now I'm gonna go check out these food trucks.